I'm Anil Kumar and now let us understand transformation when we have geometrical figures on the coordinate plane. The question here is, write the coordinates of triangle A dash B dash C dash after each transformation of triangle ABC has been applied. Triangle ABC is given to us. Let me write down ABC here, right? So it is ABC triangle. Okay. Start from the original triangle ABC each time. So starting from this triangle, you have to write down coordinates of new triangle A dash B dash C dash and these are your different kinds of transformations right so that is what the question is so you can pause the video answer the question and then look into my suggestion now to begin with let us write down the coordinate points for A B C first so A is what A will be 2 minus 4 B is what B is 2 4 and C is minus 4, 2, right? So we have some simple points. All are 2's and 4's, okay. Now, we need to write these points for the triangle A dash, B dash, C dash after translation of 4 units right and 3 units up, right? So what is going to happen? So if I say 4 units right, let us take let us take this point, right? If I move from 2, 4 units right, it will move to 6, right? So point B moves here. And then 3 units up. So from 4, it will go 3 units up. So it will go to 7. Do you see that? So it will go to 7. So that is what is going to happen. So really speaking, translations will result into addition of 4 units to the x values. That is 4 units right and addition of 3 units to y values, right? So the new points will be, a dash will be, we'll just add 4 to the x values. So if I add 4, here I get 4, and 3 to y values, so minus 1 plus 3 will be minus, minus 1, right? Minus 4 plus 3. Now b dash will be adding 4 will give us 6, and 4 plus 3 will give us 7. For c, it'll be adding 4 will give us 0 right and 3 plus 2 is 5 so these are your points now the next option here is reflection of x-axis now when you reflect then what happens let's look into that part now so reflection on x-axis so this is your x-axis so that point will be reflected so instead of 2 it becomes minus 2 do you see that so the y value changes but x remains same do you understand the transformation? So in this transformation, really speaking, what is happening is that the x value is same. So, so if the original point is x, y, then the point after this translation, reflection will be x value will remain as x and y will become minus y, correct? So, so we can write on our answer now once again for the second kind of translation which is triangle A dash, B dash, C dash again for us. But this time, X values remain same. That means 2 itself. But the Y values will become negative of existing value. So it will be 4, right? So B dash will be 2 and minus 4. And C dash will be minus 4, minus 2. You get the idea, right? So that is how it is going to be. Now let's look into reflection on Y axis. So if you are going to reflect it on the y-axis, that is, then what happens? The y values remain same. Do you see it goes there? But the x values become negative of previous one. Do you understand? That is how it is. So in this particular, the x value will become negative of original. Y remains same. So now we can again write quickly our answers. So that easy it is. You need to understand what's going on then it becomes simpler, right? So take negative of the x value, so negative 2, keep the y value same. Minus 2, 4, and c dash should be, negative will be positive 4 and 2. So that is how you could get the transformed triangle after performing the given transformations. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.